What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Um, you guys, in this video, I'm going to be simply answering um, a question from my, my buddy here, Eric. Shout out to Eric. Thank you for commenting on, on this video right here. Um, he had some really good questions, you guys, regarding softwares. Um, he had some, uh, a really, he has a really good strategy, you know, when it comes to making income and, and building an affiliate business. But what I wanted to do and what I love to do on this channel is just share my two cents, you know, share my, my advice and, and just kind of bring value any way I can. Um, I've been build, building businesses for a very long time offline and then now online since 2016, um, started as an agency going after clients and doing social media marketing and Facebook advertising services and then going into affiliate marketing and now digital courses, which is where I'm, you know, really, really fired up about and where I'm headed next. Um, just packaging up all my knowledge and scaling that and, 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 and selling that to many, many more people. But what I like to touch on, on this channel, you guys is, is all this stuff, but for the beginner, that's where I found my niche. My niche is simply helping the beginner. Like what can that beginner do? That beginner affiliate marketer, that beginner agency owner, someone who's looking to go out there and, 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 and start servicing clients when it comes to social media marketing or, or any type of, you know, paid traffic type of type of service or, you know, small business owners. A lot of you guys that are following my channel are real estate agents, insurance agents, or, or just, um, um, personal trainers, coaches, consultants, the small business owner. What I like to do with, with, with all of you guys is simply teach and help you scale online. Like what does it take to get our business online? What does it take to service clients online? Right. And, and a lot of the times online now is social media. So when it comes to my buddy, Eric here, he has a few different things that he's, that he's asking here, right? One is regarding, you know, services and, and different software. And then another one is regarding Amazon, right? Starting off as a beginner affiliate with Amazon. And I'm going to touch on both of these, okay? So I just thought I'd bring some value. I thought I'd share it with all you guys. And again, give you my advice and, and, and the direction that I would go, you know, if I was just starting out again. Um, so this first question he's asking, and, and again, this is a beginner, right? Shout out to Eric. Thank you so much for commenting, Eric. Um, I appreciate your question for sure. This is a beginner, right? This is a beginner that's looking to get onto get onto on online and looking to build something online, drive traffic online, make sales online. What's it going to take, right? So, he first started off by asking this question right here. Um, excellent video and advice, David. I'd love the insight um, on grabbing copy from Amazon instead of always trying to reinvent the wheel. So yeah, perfect. So in this video right here, I'm just simply showing people how to, how to post their Amazon affiliate link on Facebook and, and use some of the copy, which is the text that is already on that Amazon product and use it to your advantage. Use it in your post as you go and post it on Facebook, right? So, so shout out to Eric. Thanks. Uh, thanks for, you know, appreciating, you know, this video, but then he also asked, how do you think Kartra compares to other list building services like MailChimp, Aweber, and Constant Contact? See, so this is this is what I talk about on my channel a lot, you guys, is, is Kartra, first of all. Kartra is the one online software that builds my entire online business, okay? The one software. And so that's the problem when you start going after all these other softwares is the fact that now you need all these other softwares to do the same damn thing. So when it comes to building anything online, again, you're a real estate agent, you're an insurance agent, you're, you're a freelancer, it doesn't matter. It comes down to running ads, right? Either you're, you're either running ads or you're building a, a personal brand. You're an influencer, right? You're building a personal brand. You know, shout out to my son, Christian. He has a, a cousin um, who is an influencer. He's building a brand on TikTok right? Posting every day, getting hundreds of thousands of people to follow him. That's one way. So you're either going to be on these platforms, posting all damn day, getting people to like your video, getting people to see your latest dance, getting people to follow you. And you're, and, and you're doing that every day and, and you're, and you're building up, you know, some type of audience, you're building up a fan base, or you're doing that on YouTube, or you're doing that on Instagram, or you're doing that on Facebook, you're either doing that, and you're, 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 you're putting in the time to create the audience, or you're going straight to Facebook advertising, or straight to YouTube advertising, all these videos that you see running on these, all these ads that you see running on videos on YouTube, these are advertisements. So you're either going to build a personal brand, 
or you're going to run advertisements. Either one, either one, no matter what you're doing, it's now going to come down to driving that click. So as someone sees your TikTok video and they click on the link in your bio, or as someone sees your Instagram post and they click on the link in the bio, the million dollar question is where are you taking them? Okay. Where are you taking them? What's your brand? What are you building? What are you pitching? What are you sharing? Where are you taking them? Right? So that's when all these other tools are going to come, come into play. Like we're going to need all these other tools. And so since 2018, I've been talking about Kartra and the benefit of having everything in one because going this way, Eric, first of all, all these softwares, we got three different softwares he's referring to right here, right? MailChimp, Aweber, and Constant Contact. All three of these are email providers. They're email clients. They're email um, accounts. They are, they are email autoresponders. Now, that's so important because as you drive the click, you're on TikTok, you're shaking your ass on TikTok, you're trying to get people to follow you on TikTok, Instagram, LinkedIn, whatever, man. As people click, they're going to a page to enter their name and email. So hopefully you're driving them to some type of landing page, right? Or some type of, of an affiliate offer, which we're going to get there because Eric, you know, that's what, that's where he's, he's striving for is affiliate marketing. So we're going to get to his next, his next question, but let's start here real quick, because again, this is all for the beginner. Um, if I was beginning again, if I was giving advice to the beginner, this is what it is. So as you take that click again, whether it's paid traffic or whether it's, it's you building your personal brand, as you take that click somewhere that somewhere is a landing page. Most likely it's a landing page. You don't want to drive that click straight to an offer. So Eric is bringing up Amazon Associates, Amazon Affiliates. We're going to get to that. You don't want to take that click straight to an Amazon, uh, Amazon offer or, or you're on ClickBank or you're on you know, any of these other platforms. You don't want to take them straight to an offer. You want to take them straight to a page so where you can capture that lead. You need to capture that lead. Those who are winning have the biggest leads like they have the biggest list like they have leads up the up the yin yang right they have tons of leads because they're driving tons of traffic because they're a, a huge influencer like my son's cousin hundreds of thousands of, 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 of followers you're driving that attention somewhere right to capture the lead it's all about capturing the lead and that's why again with my son's cousin now he's getting brand deals. Now he's getting different brand deals, right? Different, different companies are reaching out to him to do, to, to do brand deals. Guess what? That company is directing that attention to a link. So if, if, if he's on a video, TikTok, wearing freaking this nice jacket or wearing this nice hat or wearing these nice glasses and, and the brand is paying him to do that and then he, he, he sends a shout out about the brand, He's directing that attention somewhere. And that attention is going to be a, a link. That attention is going to be a web page. So when it comes to that, that's what's necessary first is that web page, right? But after I capture that lead, what happens next? That's what these, these softwares all, are all about. MailChimp, Aweber, Constant Contact. Now, we're already coming across an issue. Now I have two different softwares that I'm going to need. I'm going to need one for the landing page to capture the lead. And then I'm going to need one of these three softwares to manage the lead, the lead, right? Because that lead, as it comes in, I need to be able to nurture that lead. I need to be able to communicate with that lead. I need to be able to, to, to stay top of mind with that lead. That's what these softwares are all about. MailChimp, Aweber, Constant Contact, they're email autoresponders. So already you're now dealing with two different types of softwares. You got one for your landing pages and then you got one for your email autoresponder, okay? Now, if you're in the type of business where you're taking appointments, where you're a consultant, you're a coach, you're a trainer, you're a real estate agent, you're an insurance agent, and now, you know, appointments, getting, getting, getting leads to schedule appointments with you is, is, is part of your business model, then you'll need some type of online calendar. A lot of people go out there and go get Calendly or they go get Schedule Once. Now you're dealing with a third software, okay? So, so you can only be, be on the free plan for so long. Even with MailChimp, you can only be on the free plan for so long and then you got to upgrade. So when you have multiple services like this, man, and you're a beginner, it's like, dude, you end up spending hundreds of dollars a month just for software, just to try to sell whatever the hell you're selling. And so as a beginner, it makes absolutely no sense to, to try to manage all these different softwares when you can do all inside of one, which is Kartra. Like Kartra is the one 
software that I've been talking about on my YouTube channel. That's what I built my entire YouTube channel around is this Kartra software talking about the power of this, my landing pages, my sales funnels, my, 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 my email autoresponder, the ability to sell my digital products, whether it's a membership course, whether it's a coaching program, whether it's a membership um, 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 service, whether it's a digital ebook, all these different services that I can provide digitally, I can sell here in my products. Again, my email autoresponder, my pages are all my pages and landing pages, my membership course. So if you are trying to package your knowledge, if you're trying to scale a digital course and sell information, right? Um, I talk about this you know, to my son all the time. There's some people that put all their videos on YouTube, and then there's some people that take a handful of videos, package it all up, and sell it, right? That's what I'm doing. So not only am I putting videos up here on YouTube every damn day, but I'm also taking a handful of videos on a particular topic, packaging all that up and selling it, right? That's my digital course. And so that's right here in my memberships. So if it wasn't Kartra, I'd have to go and get another software just for the digital courses, just for the ability to put videos in there and package it all up and sell it. That's another software. So, and then, and then there's my calendar. And then I do all my affiliate marketing through Kartra as well. So rather than having one software for my landing pages, you know, ClickFunnels, for example, and then another software for my, my email autoresponder, which would, be, which, would be, which would be MailChimp, AWeber, or Constant Contact, rather than having all that, and then rather than having a third software for my calendar, because I am a consultant, I do you know, schedule appointments every damn day with, with clients. So I need some type of online calendar system. If it wasn't for a Kartra, I'd have to go get a third software just to manage my appointments. And that's not free. Again, I could be on schedule once only for the beginning. And then after I start to get, you know, scale up, I got to pay for it. Um, and then, and then also, um, my membership. So me again, I'm scaling my knowledge. I'd have to go get a fourth software and each software is about a hundred bucks. My, the, the, I mean, first of all, these, these email providers that he's referring to over here, these are not cheap. These are anywhere from 25 and up 50 bucks, 60 bucks a month. And then, and then if you're on, if you're on click funnels, which a lot of people are using click funnels, you're, you're now doing landing pages at $97 a month. And then if you're building a, a membership course, you're probably on Kajabi or teachable or something like that. And that's another hundred bucks a month. And then again, if you're using a, a, a separate calendar system, you're spending anywhere, anywhere from 20 to 25 bucks and up per month. So it's like, dude, Eric, for the beginner, bro, for the beginner, you need Kartra. Like, that's the reason why, like I sent you a 14 day trial. And then he says over here, I'll take a rain check. It's like, bro, what do you mean? Take a rain check. Like you're not going to find all those services for $99 a month for all of them anywhere. Like Kartra is the only system. That's why I've been preaching it, you know, it over here for the past, you know, couple years is because there's no software like that. And so if you're trying and, 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 and it's not just a beginner as well. If you're anyone, let's say you've been in business forever and now you're over here online trying to, trying to build your business. You're trying to build your brand. You're trying to, you know, build out your social media platforms. You're trying to, you're trying to get online and, and really build an audience. All this stuff applies, man. You're going to need all these tools to, 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 to drive this traffic. It's all about driving, driving traffic, man. It's all about attention. It's all about attention. That's why, again, my son, he's watching these YouTube videos. He's following YouTubers that are, that are at millions of subscribers. It's like, dude, you got to reverse engineer it. You got to look at it. You got to analyze it. You got to see what the hell they're doing. Millions of subscribers. Where's the attention? What are they talking about in the video? What links are in the description? These links are taking me somewhere. Where are they taking me, right? That's what this is all about. It's all about driving that attention, driving that traffic and selling and monetizing your brand. Because a person that has 3 million subscribers or a person that has 600,000 followers on TikTok, what does it matter if they're not making money from that? If they're not monetizing it, that's what it's all about. It's not about having 600,000 600, followers on TikTok just to have 600,000 followers on TikTok. Hell no. If you have that and you're not making money from that, you're freaking retarded. If you're on YouTube and you got 3 million subscribers and you're not making money from that, you're freaking retarded. But that's not the case. Every, these people are smart. We're smart nowadays, right? People are monetizing their brand. They're monetizing their followers. And all I'm saying is all, it all comes down to the click. When I look at their description or when I watch their video, what are they talking about and where are they directing me, right? And so whether you're an advanced business owner 
or someone just starting out or trying to do something on social media, it doesn't matter. It all comes down to the click and where, you ta where you're taking them. And, and all I'm saying is that Kartra is that one-stop software. So all I offered over here, Eric, I said, man, there's no comparison. Kartra is an all-in-one software. It's the one software that runs my entire online business, and it's only $99 a month. I said, set up a 14-day trial and compare it. That's all you can do, man. So I can come over here and try to sell the hell out of you guys, you know, about Kartra and talk about freaking this and that and, and, and just try to pitch the shit out of it to you guys. Or you can just activate a 14-day trial and compare it for yourself. That's all I tell people, man. I say, dude, forget about what I'm saying. Activate a 14-day trial and go compare it to the other seven softwares you're trying to use to build an online business. It's like, dude it's night and day. It doesn't even compare. And then I also said, I'll give you all my time for free to help you get off to a fast start. It's like, dude, come on. Right. And then Eric, he apply, he replies, I'll take a rain check, a rain check. I like to see how well Amazon associates work out. I'm laid off at home and we finally drained our savings. I'm hoping an affiliate type side hustle will help me start building that savings back up. Okay. So this is where we're going to go next, you guys. Again, the beginner, shout out to Eric. Millions of people have lost their job. I'm talking to my son about this every single day. What has happened in 2020 is an absolute nightmare, and it's a freaking joke all at the same time. We are being played, and it's not even funny, right? Millions of people have lost their job. It sounds like Eric is one of them, okay? Now, what I'm sharing here is, again, for that person that may be in this position and either start now or on their last dollar or whatever. That's why Kartra has to be the software because you're not gonna afford multiple softwares, bro. Nor are you gonna want to. Like you're not gonna wanna pay for all these different softwares and then have to integrate all these different softwares and have all these different softwares talk to each other. I got click funnels for the, for the landing page, but when they opt in, they go to my Aweber. It's like, dude, that's too much going on. Like all in one, bro, all in one. Kartra is all in one, okay? At that low price. But again, if you're starting out or if you're on your last dime, that's for sure the software you need. That's going to be the most affordable. And that's what I talk about on this channel. That's what I've been on for the past couple of years. Now, if I was in this position right here on my last dime, right? Amazon Associates is not where I start out, bro. That's not where you start out at all at all. Especially if you don't have a huge email list, especially if you're not building an online brand. So if you're not like my, my son's cousin, and have hundreds of thousands of followers on a TikTok account. If you're not like that, Amazon Associates is the last place you start. So if you don't have a huge following, if you don't have a huge email list, if you're not building a YouTube channel where you're talking about one niche. So let's say, Eric, your whole niche is home and garden, or let's say it's health and wellness, or let's say it's yoga, or let's say it's meditation, or let's say it's freaking baking, let's say it's cooking, it don't matter what your niche is. That's, that's, that's tip number one though, or actually shit, what am I on, tip number 19 probably? Whatever tip I'm on right now, the tip is pick one niche. Don't go into Amazon, don't go set up an associates account and go after every freaking product. Like, don't do that. Like, don't do that. And then don't, don't start taking that link and posting it all over social media. Like, in this video right here, I'm actually showing how to post it on Facebook, but I'm also saying, no, dude, you can't just do that. Like, don't just start a Facebook account and think you're going to post your Amazon associate link everywhere and people are going to buy. Like, yeah, right. Like, yeah, right. Like that's not going to happen. It's not going to happen at all. So if you don't have all these other things going for you, Eric, like Amazon associates, bro, is the last place you want to start because first of all, the commissions are super, super low. The commissions are super low and you're not paid out until a month later and you're not paid out unless your commissions reach a hundred dollars. So it's like, most of the products on Amazon that you could possibly be selling pay you anywhere, anywhere from four to 8%. Okay. So if you're selling a freaking $50 product, you're making anywhere from four to 8%, sometimes up to 10%. But if you're selling a $50 product and you're making 10%, if you're selling a hundred dollar product and you're making 10%, like bro, it's going to take you forever. If you have no email list, if you have no social media brand, if, 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 if you don't have hundreds of thousands of followers, right, it's going to take you forever. If you're not building a YouTube channel, so now you have credibility, 
right? A lot of you guys that are following me on YouTube, what is, what is this? It's credibility. Like you're, 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 you're seeing me drop a video every freaking day. I'm like Drake over here, right? I'm dropping a hit song every freaking day, right? Every day I'm out working all you guys, right? Dropping a video every single day. That's building credibility. That's building my audience. That's building authority. That's building social proof. So when I go out there and talk about a product, people are like, shit, okay, this guy's been doing it for a long time. He has freaking hundreds of videos on YouTube. He's talking about the same damn thing. Okay, shit, he must be legit. If you don't got that, bro, like that's not where you start, right? Amazon Associates, that's not where you start. Because another thing, if you look at, if you look at any, any top Amazon affiliate, okay? And you can find them on YouTube, man. You can find them all on YouTube. Everyone's on YouTube. If you look at any of the, go, go look at camera channels. Go look at headphone channels, people that are doing reviews where their channel is based on a review. Okay, guys, today I'm going to be reviewing this new freaking iPhone 997. Let me tell you about this iPhone, right? When you come across channels like that, those are, are huge, huge channels. There's a couple you know, people that have huge camera um, review channels where all they do is review the latest Canon or the latest freaking um, um, uh, Nikon or whatever the hell it's called where they're reviewing all these different lenses and, and mics. Dude, those are huge, huge channels that have huge followings that have Amazon links in the description, right? Those right there are the, are the people who win. Like you have to be building that type of brand. So let's say, Eric, you don't have none of that, bro. Amazon Associates is not where you start. And let's say also that you don't have any of that. You don't have a huge following. You don't have a YouTube channel. You don't have a huge email list. You don't have any of that. So what you're going to want to do for sure is, well, first of all, you're going you're gonna to want to start a YouTube channel, man. Whatever the heck you're fired up about. That's why when it comes to affiliate marketing, don't just look for high paying products. Look for products that are in a niche that you're fired up about and go talk about that niche. Start a YouTube channel. That's where I would start, Eric. Start a freaking YouTube channel and start talking about that niche. Start talking about products in that industry. Talk, start talking about why you're so fired up about that industry. Start talking about your experience in that industry. Start building a following of like-minded people, okay? That's what you have to start. You should have started that yesterday, right? That's where you start, bro. Because again, it's the credibility that's going to hit you in the end. Um, you can't just post links everywhere, bro. People ain't buying your shit. I'm sorry. Um, and again, with Amazon Associates, the commission is so low where it will take you forever, bro. You're, if, you're, if, you're, if you're saying your savings is drained now, bro, your, your savings is going to be freaking like a freaking rock in the Nevada desert. Like it's going to be that dry. You know, because you're not going to see commissions from Amazon anytime soon, man. Anytime soon when you don't have all the above. The following, the YouTube channel, the email list, all that, okay? So again, let's say you don't have that, right? You don't have any of that, that influence, right? What you're going to have to do for sure, which is not going to make any sense at all, but what you would have to do is you'd have to run paid traffic. You'd have to run Facebook ads. You'd have to run Instagram ads. You'd have to run YouTube ads. You'd have to, you would have to, right? Because you have no following. You have no influence. You have no freaking YouTube channel. You have nothing. So, so, so you would have to, but at the same time you won't and nor, nor do many people do because the commission over there on the Amazon associate side is so freaking small. Like it's not even worth it. Like that's why these YouTubers, they'll do, they'll do review channels and they'll build up an affiliate marketing business. They'll build up an Amazon associates business, but they're building it around the most expensive freaking products. So there's another tip. If you're going to dive into Amazon associates, go after expensive ass products, cameras, headphones, microphones, go after expensive electronics and start building a channel and a, and a brand around that, right? Start doing reviews around the ex most expensive camera or, or, you know, things like that. You can, you can go onto Amazon and find a lot of expensive stuff. That's what you want to stay around. Okay. Cause again, just do the math. You're selling a thousand dollar product, right? You come across, you, you go get your link, you go get your Amazon associate link on Amazon and it's for a thousand dollar Canon camera, your commission's 10%. You're making a hundred bucks, bro. And, and, and it's like, dude, like, that's what I'm saying. It's not, that's not where it's at. That's not where it's at in my opinion, man. It's not, that's not where it's at. 
And, and that's where I started back in 2016 as I'm coming on to, to the internet, as I'm really taking everything I did offline and now trying to build something online. Been grinding for the last few years, building something online. Amazon Associates is what I dipped my toes in back then. And it's like, dude, after I started building it up and as I started really, you know, looking into it and, and following other people, I'm like, shit, this is going to take forever. Like these commissions are, and I even got a few, a few monthly deposits as well. And I'm like, dang, that's it. Like that, that it took forever. And that's not even like, that's not even a lot of money. Like, you know, so it's like, that's not where you start if you're starving, draining on your freaking last penny, bro. Like that's not where you start. So a few other um, affiliate platforms to take a look at could be these other platforms up here that I pulled up. So ClickBank could be a very, very, very good one for you. Um, it's a very, very popular one for a lot of affiliates, ClickBank. And the reason for it is because they're digital products. On Amazon, you're dealing with physical products, right? You're dealing with physical products. You're dealing with low ticket, a toaster, a freaking, you know, a freaking, uh, freaking towel rack, a freaking iPhone case, a freaking whatever. Like you're dealing with low ticket items on Amazon, every freaking item under the sun, but the majority of them are household items, right? Um, low ticket. That's the problem with, 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 with Amazon is that it's, it's a physical product and it's low ticket. It takes forever to be paid out and you got to hit a threshold of at least a hundred bucks over here on ClickBank. This is where you can come over here and you can pick all these different niches. You can pick all these different niches and you can go find products inside these niches. And the majority of them are digital type of products, meaning courses, coaching programs, things of that nature. You can come over here and find products where the commission is way, way higher. You know, you sell one of these and you're making $235 per sell. Like that's where you want to be. You do a few of those per week and you'll be up in your savings account in no time, right? But again, you're either building a personal brand, you have a huge email list, or you're running paid traffic. When you come to, to commissions this high, that's when paid traffic makes sense. That's when paid traffic makes sense is when you have commissions in the hundreds of dollars. Those are the type of products you want to go after, man, is, is digital products. You can find a ton of them in ClickBank. Um, and, 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 and the reason for it is because the majority of digital products are sold at a high price point, $1,000, $1,500, $2,000. These are people who are selling their knowledge. These are people who are selling courses, membership courses, coaching programs, and they're giving you the ability to become an affiliate and make an extra income from it, right, by simply referring it. But again, you got to be running ads, man. You got to either be build, either be building that personal brand like crazy or you're running ads, bottom line. And again, that's why Kartra, that's why I spent some time on the software, talking about the software in the beginning of this video, because that software, you're going to need it for every, everything, man. You're going to need it to drive that traffic to a landing page to capture the lead. You're going to need it for an email autoresponder to nurture that email list so you can then email that list future offers, right? Because one day I may, I may send them that link to take a look at that offer. Another day I might send them this other link to take a look at this other offer, right? Right here, super affiliate, John Cristani's auto webinar funnel. Look, dude, you can come in here for free. You set up a ClickBank account for free, just like Amazon, right? Come over here and you start promoting. You get your own link right here. I click promote. I come over here. I get my link. So let's call this one, let's just call this one um, whatever. And then I can generate hop link, okay? Now this is my link right here. So this link is where I would post either in my email, I'd send this in my email, or I would run a Facebook ad, you know? Like I would run a Facebook ad to a landing page and once I capture the lead, then I'll send them here, right? Because this is my unique affiliate link. And every time I make a sell, I make $556. Like how insane is that? That right there is where it's at. Stop messing around with $5 commissions on Amazon, bro. It ain't going to happen. You got to come over here and go after high ticket products. And again, the majority of the high ticket products are digital. Okay. They're not physical products. Although you can find physical products like a camera, microphone, things like that. But the majority of 90, I would say 98%. 98% of every product on Amazon is low ticket, low ticket, super low ticket. I'm talking super low ticket, super low ticket, under a hundred bucks. So it's like, shit, dude, if I'm making 10% or if I'm making 8% of, of $60, like, come on, dude, that, 
you know, so I think I hit that one over the head enough, you guys, but this is where I would be, man. I would be on ClickBank looking at some of these offers and even maybe ShareSell. ShareSell is a super popular affiliate uh, marketplace as well. And this is for other types of products like fashion and home and garden. Um, you can come here, set up a free account and get a link to a lot of these different um, um, products. So look, fashion merchants, I can come in here and get a link for top from top companies, Jane, Trunk Club, Dogs, T Public. Like I can get a link for for um, let's see, what else do we got? Uh, Busted Tees, Sunfrog, Primary, The Real Real. So there's just Jane. There's there's real companies in here where I can get a, an affiliate link and start you know promoting these other products. But again, look, join our program and earn seven percent, seven percent, bro. Like look, this shirt right here probably costs twelve dollars. I'm gonna make seven percent. That's what I'm saying. That's why I don't really mess with a lot of these affiliate programs because you got to be building a huge brand around it, man. You got to build a huge brand because you're not running Facebook ads to that at all. Like 7% commission on a freaking $10 freaking bathing suit. Like, yeah, right, dude. Like that's not going to feed our family like at all at all. So normally I wouldn't even mess with share cell, but you guys could for sure take, you know, check it out because it is a popular one. And then JV zoo is another one where there's a bunch of digital products so you can set all these all these platforms are free so you can come in here and set up a free account on all of them and then just dive in and look at the different offers look at the commissions and see if it's worth it okay but just keep in mind man you're going to either need to be building a personal brand or you're going to be running paid traffic bottom line and if you're running paid traffic that's why Kartra makes all the sense in the world you have to minimize your expenses especially in the beginning especially if you're on your last dollar and you need to you need to be able to leverage the best software out there and Kartra is definitely the best one um for the money right max bounty another popular affiliate program you can set up a free account go in here and look at a bunch of different offers um and then and then that that's really really the only ones that I would recommend. I wouldn't recommend any other ones, man. I wouldn't recommend Amazon Associates. You know, if anything, start at ClickBank and start looking at some of these 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 products. What you're looking for in, on the Click, ClickBank side is the Gravity Score. It's all about this Gravity Store score, 207. The Gravity Score, and and you can also search by popularity. That's what I would do. Search by popularity. So this Gravity Score, it it determines how popular that product is. So this product is, is selling like hotcakes right now. A lot of people on the, on the ClickBank platform are, 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 are succeeding selling this offer. So you may want to do that, right? Or, or you can look at this other one. There's so many different ones in here. You can, you can look at all these different niches. Like I chose e-business and e-marketing. I can go affiliate marketing. I can go blog marketing. I can look at all of these different categories, man, all these different categories and find products that other people are selling that I can make a commission from, right? Social media marketing, education, all these different green products, health and fitness, so many niches in here, you guys, that you can search from um, and, and, and grab your own link and start promoting it. But don't just blast it on social media, man. Actually build a brand around it. Build a brand around it, around it or start running paid traffic. And again, that's why Kartra is a game changer when it comes to nurturing that lead capturing that lead and 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 just managing that lead overall you need software and kartra is the one for that so that there's a there's a link in the description you guys profit with kartra dot online um there's a 14-day trial you can you know compare it to whatever the heck you're using and see if it doesn't you know change your business so shout out to eric thank you so much for for commenting eric thank you for your questions i hope that made sense i hope i didn't ramble you know too too much but um if you have any questions drop me a comment below and um start there man start with kartra it's it's the most affordable one it's the most effective one and then look into look into clickbank um for a higher pain commission and, and start with that. And again, man, start your brand, bro. Start building your brand, start a YouTube channel. Everybody right now, man, go subscribe to Eric's YouTube channel. Let's get, let's get him some motivation. Let's start subscribing to his YouTube channel over here. So let's get him a little bit of momentum and get some people over here. Subscribe to his YouTube channel, whatever you're talking about over here, man, let, let, let's, 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 um, let's, um, um, tune it in and narrow it in to affiliate marketing. Look, man, I'm seeing right here music. I'm seeing it looks like a church. It looks like music, bro. You can start looking at music. Like you can go to you can go to freaking uh, what's that popular um, uh, music store? Um, um, shit, what's that, what's that popular one called? Um, 
Oh, dude, it's going to bug me. Poplar Music Store. It is called um, Guitar Center. Guitar Center. Look, dude, I can go to Guitar Center. Guitar Center. And I could become an affiliate at Guitar Center. So look, I'm pretty sure they have an affiliate program. I'm pretty, pretty sure. See, looking at Eric's channel, look, bro, I'm just going to assume that you're in. Actually, I don't even know. I'm just assuming. But let's just say you're into music because it looks like everybody's singing. If you're into music, start talking about products and instruments in the music space. And, and, and come over here to, to Guitar Center. If you scroll to the bottom, let's see. Where is their affiliate program? Right there. Bam. Affiliate program. I can come to Guitar Center set up a free affiliate account and start getting links to all of these products, guitars, pianos, keyboards, microphone, bro. And then I can take all that and I can start talking about it on my YouTube channel. Right. And then I can start linking everything in the, in the description. That's what I would do, Eric. If that's what you're into, I don't know. I'm over here seeing keyboards and speakers. Like if that's what you're into, bro, start there. You want to try to build something around what you're fired up about, man, what you're passionate about, what excites you. Like, don't try to jump into an industry that you have no passion in and no interest in whatsoever, because it's going to seem like homework. It's going to seem like freaking a chore and it's going to seem like hell. You're going to be doing it just for the money. And guess what? The money ain't even going to come. So you got to be fired up about it because it's the only thing that's going to keep you in the game. It's the only thing that's going to get you fired up to want to come over here to even talk about it. Why do you think I'm over here talking about Kartra? Why do you think I'm over here building a YouTube channel? Because I'm talking about stuff that excites me. I'm talking about stuff that I have experience in. I'm talking about stuff that gets me fired up, right? And, and if I can make a commission from it all, right? That's exactly what I'm doing over here, man. I'm talking about Kartra on YouTube and tons of you are signing up with Kartra, which is allowing me to make money, right? It's like, dude, it's a win-win. And then on top of it all, as you build out that channel and you start to get a ton of subscribers, you then start getting paid from YouTube with ad money, right? And so that's where I'm at now also. I get a check every month from Kartra, my affiliate marketing business, and then I get a check every month from YouTube, which is my YouTube ad money. So it's like, dude, to talk about something that fires me up on a stupid video, posting it on YouTube, and then eventually getting paid from it, that's a win-win, right? So I hope that made sense, Eric. Shout out to Eric. Everybody subscribe to his channel, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Over and out.